Preventing theft the easy way. Our Bismarck Mandan community is ranked as one of the safest places in the entire nation to live. We have fewer crimes such as murder, rape, and kidnapping. As a result of that, our citizens tend to live a much more carefree lifestyle. They also tend to worry less about personal crimes and violent crimes. However, just because we're safe, it doesn't mean that our property is. In fact, we often make it too easy for thieves by leaving our valuables in our cars. Purses, checkbooks, laptops, briefcases, and other related items are some of the most commonly reported items stolen every year. The good news is this can be easily prevented. How do you keep someone from stealing 400 CDs out of your car? Don't leave 400 CDs in your car. Remember, vehicles are designed for transportation, not security. So unless you're driving an armored car, leave your valuables safely in the trunk, or better yet, leave them at home. But even in your trunk, you need to understand that your valuables are not 100% safe. With a certain amount of force, thieves can open that trunk as well. You also need to check your vehicle to see if you have a button inside the car that allows access to the trunk. If the thief breaks into the car, he can then gain access to your trunk and your valuables. If you're driving a pickup, no trunk, right? So hide your valuables in the vehicle. Put them behind or under the seat, or shove them up under the dash. Then throw a coat or blanket over them, anything you can do to make them invisible. If a thief doesn't see a thing worth stealing, there's a good chance he's not going to break in. Some people have their guns hanging in their rear window. Although it may seem cool, that's like making an announcement saying, come steal me. Don't forget stereo system stickers, too. They're not so cool when you come back to your car to find your window smashed and your stereo gone. Some people also protect themselves by getting a stereo with a removable faceplate. Just remember to take it with you. Another option is to get a stereo with slide-out components. And if you really want to cover all your bases, record the serial numbers of your stereo components. When police make an arrest for a theft, they'll often solve many cases, recovering lots of stolen CDs. But without your name or initials, it's next to impossible to determine who's the rightful owner. And don't forget to take a permanent marker and put your name or initials and phone number on each CD and CD case. Marking the top side of the CD will not affect the sound reproduction. You should also mark the CD case that you transport your CDs in. You need to remember if you have 100 CDs in your case and they're $15 a piece, you are looking at a $1,500 loss if they're stolen. And of course, you really don't need to store all 400 of your CDs in your car. It would make much more sense just to take two or three along with you, the CDs that you plan to listen to. There's over 300 miles of streets in Bismarck and 100 miles of streets over Mandan. There's about 100,000 vehicles registered in the two communities. We just don't have enough police officers to put one on every corner to watch everybody's vehicle, so we need your help. If you are out and about in your vehicle and you have to take property along, take the precautions necessary to protect it. Help us protect your property by not leaving valuables in your vehicle, lock them securely in the trunk, or better yet, leave them at home.